It's a protest that has lasted weeks and spread across countryside and cities. Police and army troops attempt to clear protesters blocking part of a road in Florencia in the southern Kakatar province. They use tear gas. Demonstrators throw petrol bombs. At least 11 people are arrested. The nationwide protests are in support of a strike by small-scale farmers. They say the government's agricultural and economic policies have left them unable to make any profit. For more than 200 years, farmers have been ruined, violated and unrecognized within Colombia's social policies. The agricultural sector has been abandoned. A curfew was imposed overnight to control outbreaks of violence and looting. It's just days since similar measures were set in the capital, Bogotá, following mass protests which descended into violent clashes. At least two people were killed, leading the president to send in troops to patrol the streets. Farming leaders have rejected the violence. They've reached a partial agreement with the government and cleared many roads of barricades. But there's still much anger throughout the country, and the government has yet to negotiate an end to the strike. Emily Thomas, BBC News.